Hi guys, welcome to another Vlogmas video. Today we are going to be decorating my room. As you can see, my room is a little, it's not too messy. Also, before I get comments, why do I have a microwave and refrigerator in my room? It's because when I was at university, I lived in a dorm and we got this stuff. We don't have anywhere else to put it, so it lives here. It's just how it is. It's actually really convenient, especially when we have hurricane season because normally my family like comes over if there's a hurricane and stuff and we have extra space to put things and we can also cook um, like different microwavable foods in this microwave as well as the one in my kitchen. So it's actually really convenient to have, um, but that is why I have that. I just wanted to explain that before this video officially starts. So my room is complete. I absolutely love how it turned out this year. It looks the same almost every year, but I just thought I would show you guys the 2020 version. So on this wall, we have like just pictures of memories and I actually destroyed this on accident. So I now have two little decor pieces. This was a little mistletoe and this was attached to it, but it broke off. So I just made another cute little decoration. We also have the big bow. That's like my favorite bow. We've had that bow for a long, long time. Coming over to my bed, this is what it looks like. Um, I took this pillow from our living room. I should get new like garland stuff to put on the sides like a greenery, but I just, I don't know guys, like at this rate, it looks fine. I kind of like the way it looks. It's like this every year. So I'm just going to leave it. This is my favorite part of my room. Um, this is my little mini Christmas tree. I literally just shove it in my closet, get it out every year. A couple of the ornaments fall off, but then I just put them back on. I got all of the stuff I think from Target. Really convenient easy simple this is one of my little favorite ornaments here I have a little Starbucks bag and then I have a little bow here obviously the little star I put the clock here uh, just because I thought it complemented the room really well um, this I got from an old co-worker uh, for my birthday so I just decided I'd put it on the tree uh, my body lotion over there this is my favorite lotion if you're wondering you can get it on Amazon it is by the Weston hotels um, it smells so good the scent is white tea alloy aloe whatever you want to say but it's so nice smells so good and it brings back like such good memories from when i did like dance competitions and stuff my little peep i love peeps they're so cute and this is a christmas themed one i really like this because um normally peeps are associated with easter and this one's a christmas themed one so i just put him there chilling out and then we have my candle i think that was for my cousin um from my birthday and the little tree skirts also for my cousin so oh and the tree topper is also for my cousin again i've already addressed this situation so i'm not going to go into it yoga mat always lives here this is my pajamas that is the list of secret santa pairs that i have so i will not be showing that my hello sign that is so random honestly i i guess I had nowhere else to put it or whatever but I thought it was really cute so it's just there this is also another one of my favorite things I actually just got done dusting I don't know if you saw in the other clips but it was like super dusty I should just talk to you guys like this dusting is my least favorite like chore so every time I um, update my room decor um, I tend to dust just because you know keep everything fresh and it just I don't know I've kind of just set that for myself because I hate dusting. It's my least favorite out of all of the chores. I'd rather do dishes, laundry, vacuum, anything but dust. But I did dust for you guys today and half for myself. So this is my little tray. Those are my grandparents. They have passed away. 
I always keep this here because I really like it. The photo in the frame actually came with the um, tray because this this whole this set the picture and the um, tray was my grandma's so I don't know it's just really nice to have here and it matches really well. I have this little teddy bear. These are just earrings. I like to keep them for easy access so if I'm like going somewhere I'll just like throw them on. I have my little Christmas tree. This is from um, Snow Village. It's like a collection that you can get at like, I don't know, like Hallmark. We have a big collection, but we don't have any place to put it. At our old house, it was so pretty. I don't know if I could try to find a picture. Yeah, it's really cute little town, but I stole one of the trees because I like it as decor. Um, this is a little bell. I don't know if you guys remember when we went on the Polar Express. It's not really focusing. It wants to focus on that picture. But this is my Polar Express bell. If you haven't seen that video, I'll link it down below. But that was such a fun time um, with my family and stuff. We all went on this Polar Express little adventure on a train and we all got bells. So I decided since it was Christmas time to just put the little bell out so it's easier to be seen. This is my perfume. I only really wear this on like special occasions and stuff, but it smells so good. It's Tobacco Vanilla by Tom Ford. You can get it on Amazon. It's like kind of expensive. That's another reason why I just like I'll only use it for like special occasions. My little teddy bear is here. This is a little selenite crystal ball. I know it's super random, but I love this, like the look of that. Like, I just think it's really pretty. And I got it from a YouTuber I follow, Amanda31409. She like sells crystals sometimes and stuff. So I got that and it honestly looks like a little snowball. So. I just kept it there, it always lives there. Um, coming down here, it's not too exciting. I just keep this stuff here so I can have some decor. I hate this stuff because this is the stuff that gets really dusty and stuff. This is all my jewelry pieces, like my most commonly worn jewelry. I just keep it here so it's not like all messy. And this is a perfume. I don't even know if it's still good or not. Honestly, I just keep it for decor. Um, it was a Juicy Couture and had this like hot pink bow. I love that color hot pink, but it just really didn't match here. So I took it off. This is just a random trinket with like more jewelry pieces and stuff. Guys, who remembers the eye dog? And when I was cleaning, I broke off the tail. So that's super sad, but I don't know. I just keep it here again because it matches. I begged for that for a long, long time, a long time ago. Back there, it's just like memory stuff like cards and like, like invitations to like weddings and I don't know, just memorabilia. But I love that because it like keeps everything organized and tucked away. This is my favorite candle. Um, I got this for my birthday three years ago. The scent is Harvest Pumpkin and I absolutely love that. It's like smells like fall. I don't know the best way to describe it. It's just, it's fall in a candle and I absolutely love it. Um, this is my fake Cartier stuff. Honestly, I'm debating on getting rid of this. So let me know if you would want to like do a giveaway with this or like if anyone wants to buy this and like is watching this video, contact me on Instagram. I never wear this, that bracelet. This is the ring. I'm definitely going to keep that even though my fingers are like a little fat right now. This is just some sage. Um, I got it in a package with a crystal. And then this is my little Anne sign. I don't know. I just... I thought it was cute. And then the last little cubby hole, we have the little box that my perfume came in. This old fashioned perfume thing, this t little fake topiary thing that I got from Target. And then that little A that I think I got from Anthropology. I think I forgot to dust the sides of these things, which really sucks. I'm not going to do that. And then I think this is the last like part um, of my room, which is this mirror. Looks good because I just dusted it and it's all looking brand new. Uh, this is where I take a lot of my photos and stuff. I'm actually going to start setting up my camera because I'm going to film my favorite Christmas ornaments video. I've been wanting to do this video for quite a while now, probably since last year. So, I mean, might as well get on that. Today is Saturday, so might as well be productive in the YouTube world. I don't know, I think I say this every time, but if you guys are wondering what camera I use, I use the Canon 70D. There's a lot more updated cameras these days, but I got this one in 2015. This is what the lens looks like. It's a Sigma 1.4. This is the really old version of this lens. Um, I got it off of eBay from a pawn shop, I think, or some like camera shop. I don't know. I got it for a pretty good price. It's kind of old, but it still does the job all right. And then this is the new microphone. I think I've already shown you guys when I like unboxed it and stuff, um, but it's the Rode VideoMic Pro. Here's a little tripod. I actually have two tripods. They're both kind of broken, which is interesting, but again, they get the job done right. So I think I'm going to eat something and then start filming. 
Okay, so I totally failed showing you guys the food. It was just my chicken little meal from Fit Life, which you've seen a million times, I think. Um, so I just had lunch, had a little shake as well. And now we are going to be filming my Christmas ornaments video that I've been wanting to film for a while. Even turned on the fairy lights. I almost never turn these on because I feel like the batteries are running out. Anyway, but I just wanted to put some more Christmas cheer in the video. And yeah, so I guess we are going to get to filming. Okay, so I just got done filming my video and now I'm just gonna be editing probably the rest of the day. I just got done watching like some of Adeline and Sierra's vlogs, Lore DIY. I love watching their Vlogmas vlogs. I honestly like think it would be like super fun to like hang out with them. Like I don't know if they like me or not, but you know, I like watching their videos. So that's all that matters. My goal is to edit three videos today like vlogs and stuff um i don't know if that's gonna be possible but i really need to i have tomorrow also to edit and stuff but i just want to get like a lot of editing done and stuff um because obviously you guys know i work tuesday wednesday thursday i don't edit or film those days really um i really want to do a work week in my life like to share like what i do because a lot of you guys are curious about that so I'm still thinking um, and tossing that around in my head like what should I show what should I not show and stuff um, just because you know I don't know I love to keep like work and personal life like separate so yeah I'm still debating on that but right now I'm just going to edit my videos um, and try to get as far as I can before dinner I've successfully edited and almost uploaded two videos I have one more to go that was like my goal for today to just get everything under control so I just have one more to do and then I'm gonna eat probably and then maybe after dinner I'll do like the thumbnails and description box and stuff and if you didn't already know I do have an affiliate with TubeBuddy. TubeBuddy is an amazing company that helps you optimize your videos. So check it out if you have your own channel or whatever. My link is in the description box. This is not sponsored at all. I'm just mentioning it to you. Um, but yeah, I'm going to finish up. I have one more video to edit and get on YouTube and then I'm going to eat. Yes. I love it when I'm like super productive and I'm like on top of everything. It's the best feeling in the world. Also, I got a package, so I'm so excited to open it. I don't even know what it is. It's some package from Amazon. We'll see. We'll do that after I edit this video. This one shouldn't take too long, which I'm happy about. It's my unboxing video. Okay, so we have officially finished the third video of the day. I'm so happy. Ugh, goals are met. Well, not completely because I want to, I want to get them all scheduled, have the tags, the description box all done, um, but I can do that after dinner and it doesn't take a long time to do that. Okay, so I'm actually going to do the opposite with this box because this is a present from my aunt most likely. So I'm going to be wrapping this. I'll probably wrap it tomorrow just so I can like have some content. Um, but yes, I thought that it was something else, but it's clearly not. Um, it's from my aunt to me. I hope I'm not doing anything bad to it by tipping it up like this, but I don't want to show any addresses. So I will probably end up wrapping this tomorrow. I'm glad that my mom texted me and reminded me that Aunt Wendy was getting me something or else I would have just torn in this box. So yeah, um, I'm gonna eat and then finish up my work stuff. So I'm having my regular lunch for dinner. So what I have here is my egg whites, celery. There's only two more shortbread cookies in here as you, oh, whoa, I just dropped it in this little box. So I just brought the box in and then I have some Triscuits. I love Triscuits, especially the garden herb or the garlic. There's like a roasted garlic. That's really, really good. Okay, so I got the three videos I wanted to get done, all done. I'm so happy. Oh, man. But after that, I just ate like you just saw, like my little meal there. And then I just chilled and relaxed because I had such a productive day. I'm just coming on to end the video. So if you guys enjoyed this, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.